morning Lalaos, it's boy Jamesy back with another video. I am recording this live from my hotel here in Bangkok, Thailand. I am quarantining right now for 15 days. Today is day 6 I believe. So you know today's video is just gonna be me showing you you know what the day in live really looks like. Show you around the hotel. Yeah, hope you enjoy the video. morning I wake up at around 8 a.m. and by 8 30 there will be food served right at my door um, and every day you can sort of choose pick and choose what you want to uh, what, to, what you want to get for, for breakfast today we got some uh, you know this is called the healthy breakfast so we got some poached eggs some cereal cereal uh, some bread some fruits things like that but you can choose you know there's American breakfast um, Thai breakfast things like that so I've been here for six days uh, some days uh, the breakfast is you know pretty good but today on today honestly uh, uh. okay so I've just finished my breakfast and that was honestly by far the worst one yet um, but it's my fault because it was called healthy breakfast on the menu what are you thinking games what are you thinking <sighs> just never never get those but right after breakfast usually what I do is I place my order for my meals the next day so let me show you what it looks like so yes after, right after breakfast I place my order for my meals the next day they use a Google form uh, it's pretty straightforward you choose what you want to eat for breakfast lunch and dinner the next day they have Thai options uh, Asian options uh, American stuff uh, pretty good uh, variety some meals like the pad thai here I'm not sure if I've just been deprived of good Thai food or just been deprived of good Asian food but man some of the stuff here is pretty on point so this is what I usually do after breakfast okay so while we're here why don't I show you around the, the hotel so I'm not sure if I mentioned it but this place that I'm quarantining at is called Hyatt place and it is a four-star hotel but honestly, it feels like a five-star hotel. So I'm gonna show you around. One thing I love most about this place is the huge windows, as you can see. The massive windows here really makes you feel better. You know, it doesn't feel like you're just trapped. Um, and the reason why I chose this place too is because uh, there is a separation between where you sleep and where you work. A lot of the quarantine places that, you know, the options out there, you only get a room, right? So you wake up and then you go to the table like right next to the bed. And then you spend the whole day there and then you go, to, you go to bed. I feel like I would definitely go insane. Uh, so one thing that was really important to me was having more space, right? So if you chose a five-star hotel, like for example, Hilton, which is right there with the same price. Uh, and I paid around 2000 USD to, to be here for 15 days, three meals a day. For the same price, you will only get a room in, in Hilton, like just a room. So this place is, uh, is pretty great. I love the huge windows again you can see lots of buildings compared to Vancouver right a lot more buildings uh, you know I guess you can call it a, a concrete jungle <laughs> okay so let me show you around the, the apartment so starting over here is my setup so one thing that I'm super uh, happy about the internet is pretty good like I can actually game here I can actually do like watch shows here so that's really really great um, they're also super nice and accommodating this whole uh, office chair you just got to request it and they give it to you so got my setup here this is where I really spent most of my day uh, starting here and then moving along you have this um, sort of like a living area right there's a couch there's your TV um, this is where I eat right just because this is taking all the space this is where I eat there's a side table here there's a nice living area right here with a lot again lots of uh, windows lots of natural light it really doesn't feel like I'm quarantining at all like it's day six right now and I feel like I'm just chilling right I'm just chilling in the hotel on vacation so it feels nice to just look outside and have so much space and then going into the room right here as you can see this is like a makeshift workout area I'm not sure if they, they meant it to be a workout area but it became a workout area for me and they're super um, nice to you know give you know dumbbells 
So these are things that you got to request ahead of time and I'm lucky that um, you don't have to pay extra for it. So got some dumbbells here for workouts. Um, I also brought a lot of my own stuff. So I got my ab roller, all this stuff, all this fitness stuff that I brought. Um, Cause I hear a lot of people gain a lot of weight while they're quarantining and we, we don't want to gain weight, right? We don't want to gain weight. So lots of workout stuff here, right? It's like a makeshift workout area over here. Again, huge windows. You can see the outside world, right? So you don't feel like you're going insane. And then moving on to the bed. So it's a nice king size bed here, right? Lots of room, lots of room. And then moving on to the toilet. Toilet is also mm, beautiful, okay? So the toilet here, right? Lots of space, lots of space. Oh, I was tripped. Lots of space, right? You got a shower here, right? Man, the water pressure, bam! So strong and so good. Okay, so water pressure here and the, the best, wait, wait, I'll get to that a bit later, right? A nice sink area and they have a separate bathtub for your baths, right? So it's all about pre-planning, right? I didn't know that there was gonna be a bathtub. Wait, did I? Okay, I did. So I bought from Vancouver some bath bombs from Lush, you know? Let's check it out, check it out. I took one bath already so far and oh man, it feels so premium over here, right? The best part about this entire hotel, this entire hotel, you might think, oh, nice space, nice separation, nice huge windows. You might think all that makes this hotel great, but that's not the case. The best part about this hotel, and I miss you so much, is this thing, my friend. Do you know what this is? I haven't seen this in like years. I haven't used this in years. Check it out. Man, I miss you. I'm, I miss you, man. I miss you. Yes, so for those of you who don't know what that is, it's a uh, bidet. So you use that to wash your bum after you poop. And that's something that they didn't have in Vancouver. And honestly, it was one of the biggest culture shocks I have uh, when I was in Vancouver. Right? I was like, man, people just wipe and they're done. What the hell, man? So, but yeah, so this is, uh, this is the hotel. It's super spacious. This apartment is, it's kind of sad, but this apartment is bigger than my apartment in Vancouver. <laughs> it's kind of sad. But if you haven't seen the apartment tour, link somewhere here. Okay, so right after eating breakfast, right after placing my order for meals the next day, the next thing I like to do is really just take in the scenery for a few minutes, right? Just a few minutes. Just look at this concrete jungle. Really take it all in. And then I like to sit down here and, you know, read because guys the biggest do you know what the biggest room is in this world it's not this hotel room it is the room for improvement all right so i always like to sit down here uh read a few pages of, uh, of a good book uh just to start off my day all right so it is now 12 30 p.m uh, i just spent the morning uh reading and just chilling so now lunch is served 12.30 and look at what we got. Let's see. So this is one of my absolute favorite Thai dishes, right? Um, it's called Pat Gra Pao and I got it with pork, so Pat Gra Pao Boom, right? Let's try it, right? We had a really bad tasting breakfast because it was healthy, but this time, you know, let's see. Let, let, let's try it, let's try it, let's try it, let's try it. All right, again, Pat Gra Pao, one of my absolute favorite Thai dishes in the world. Let's see, man. Oh, spicy. One more bite, one more bite, one more bite. A little bit of egg. Mmm. Mmm, delicious. It's a little spicy, but really good, right? Compared to our breakfast this morning. Mmm. So if you're ever quarantining and you have a choice between Thai stuff or American stuff or Western stuff, you know what to choose. Okay guys, <clears throat> you know, when I tell you something spicy, and you ask me how spicy, oh, it's this spicy man. Oh my lord, I'm sweating balls. Oh. Oh. <coughs> but that was so delicious. Woo. Mm -hmm. 
after lunch, uh, I usually play games with my homies back in Malaysia. So I'm lucky to be back in Bangkok or this part of the world because I can finally game again with my um, with the homies, you know, from home. So I usually spend you know, a few hours playing games. Uh, I'm also super lucky that the internet here is fast enough that, you know, which allows me to play games. So yeah, I usually spend most of my time here and it kills many 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 hours for me so right now it's about 3 p.m and we're going to get a covid test so during this entire 15 day uh, quarantine you need to get a covid tested three times once when you first check in second time is day six which is today and third time right before you check out so those are the only three times when you can go outside and breathe some outdoor air. So, yeah, let's go get our nose violated. Mm -hmm. Okay, it is now 5 p.m. and usually at this time I get a workout in. So as you can see, as I mentioned, here's a little workout area. Um, was able to rent a couple of dumbbells, brought some gear myself. So I get a good workout in, burn an hour, hour and a half. So yeah, that's what I usually do at 5 p.m. Time is now 7 p.m. I've just finished working out, finished showering, and I am here having my last meal of the day. Got some spaghetti bolognese, some minestrone soup, as well as uh, cream puff. Now I know, I know what I said uh, to not get the American Western food here, but I ordered this yesterday. Okay, so cut me some slack. All right. But anyway, I'm just gonna finish this, and the rest of the night is pretty chill. I usually just watch some shows with my girlfriend uh, virtually. Um, and call it a night by, by midnight. But if you enjoyed uh, watching this video, if you think it's pretty interesting, make sure you leave a like, make sure you subscribe, and become a Lalo today. We're trying to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. I'm super excited to show you content uh, and show you around Thailand and my life here um, once I'm out of quarantine. So if you're into that, make sure you join the family. All right. Once again, my name is James. I make videos every single week. And. Yeah, I'll see you next week. Peace.